Appian Certified Lead Developer ACD 300 Exam Updated Dumps can help you study all the related topics. Share some Appian ACD 300 Exam Updated Dumps here. 1. Your application contains a process model that is scheduled to run daily at a certain time, which kicks off a user input task to a specified user on the first time zone for morning data collection the time zone is set to the default pm time zone in this situation what does the pm time zone reflect a the time zone of the server where app plan is intuited b the line zone of the user who most recently published the process model. C. The default time zone for the environment as specified in the administration console. D. The time zone of the user who is completing the input task. 2. You need to design a complex Appian integration to call a RESTful API. The RESTful API will be used to update a case in a customer's legacy system. What are three prerequisites for designing the integration? A. Define the HTTP method that the integration will use. B. Understand the content of the expected body. Diluting each field type and their limits. C. Understand whether this integration will be used in an interface or in a process model. D. Understand the different error codes managed by the API and the process of error handing Emma Paul. E. Understand the business rules to be applied to ensure the business logic of the data. 3. You have created a web API in Appian. With the following URL to call it https colon slash slash example appian cloud dot com slash suite slash web appy slash yusuf underscore managefnant slash users username smiley face equals john smith which is the connect syntax for referring to the username parameter a h t t py request query parameters users username bhttpyrequest u sees username chttpyrequest form data username dhttpyrequest query parameters username 4. As part of an upcoming release of an application, a new nullable field is added to a table that contains customer data. The new field is used by a report in the upcoming release and is calculated using data from another table. Which two actions should you consider when creating the script to add the new field? A. Create a script that adds the held and leaves it null. B. Create a rollback script that removes the field. C. Create a script that adds the field and then populate it D. Create a rollback script that clears the data from the field. E. Add a view that joins the customer data to the data used in calculation. 5. You are presented with the following application requirement. Users must be able to navigate throughout the application while maintaining complete visibility in the application structure and easily navigate to previous locations. Which Appian interface pattern would you recommend? A. Use Bullis as cards pattern on the home page low prominently display application choices. B. Implement an activity history pattern to track an organization's activity measures. C. Implement a drill down report pattern to show detailed information about report data. D. Include a breadcrumbs pattern on applicable inert ACEs to show the organizational hierarchy. 6. Your Agile Scrum project requires you to manage two teams, with three developers per team. Both teams are to work on the same application in parallel. 
How should the work be divided between the teams? Avoiding issues caused by cross-dependency. A. Group epics and stones by technical difficulty and allocate one team the more challenging stories b group epics and stones by feature and allocate work between each team by feature c allocate stories to each team based on the cumulative years of experience of the team members d have each team choose the stones they would like to work on based on personal preference 7 you need to export data using an out-of-the-box Appian smart service. Which two formats are available? Or data generation? A. CSV B. XML C. Excel D. J. S. D. N 8. You are required to configure a connection so that Jira can inform Appian when specific tickets change. Using webhook. Which three required steps will allow you to connect both systems? A. Create a web API object and set up the correct security. B. Configure the connection in Jira specifying the UR and credentials. C. Create a new API key and associate a service account. D. Give the service account system administrator privileges. E. Create an integration object from Appland to Jira to periodically check the ticket status. 9. You are the lead developer for an Appian project. In a backlog refinement meeting you are presented with the following user story. As a restaurant customer. I need to be able to place my food order online to avoid waiting in line for takeout. Which two functional acceptance criteria would you consider? Good. A. The user will click save, and the order information will be saved in the order table and have audit history. B. The user will receive an email notification when their order is completed. C. The system MUT handle up to 500 unique orders per day. D. The user cannot submit the form without filling out all required fields. 10. You add an index on the searched field of a MySQL table with many rows, greater than 100k. The field would benefit greatly from the index in which three scenarios. A. The field contains a textual shot business code. B. The field contains long unstructured text such as a hash. C. The field contains many date times, covering a large range. D. The ad contains dig integers, above and below zero. E. The field contains a structured JSON.